population explosion and birth control population explosion we know that in spite of many attempts to check population growth the birth rate is still high but the death rate has been checked because of the development and extension of medical facilities family planning is not practiced sincerely on a large scale especially in rural areas this situation has resulted into large proportion of youth 15 to 24 years 2% along with the aged 32% in 2011 who are dependent on relatively small workforce of the population this large proportion of young population puts great pressure on the available medical educational and other social amenities it is estimated that due to the rapid population growth 25 million people are homeless and 171 million people have no access to safe drinking water development experience of recent years shows that there is a long run trend towards slow growth of population in a country this is secured by balance between birth and death rates before the commencement of modern economic development countries were in the first stage of demographic transition at that time countries had slow population growth because of a balance between high birth and death rates but as a result of economic development developed countries have again attained slow growth in their population birth and death rates in these have become quite low such features have been noticed during the third stage of demographic transition birth control with the rapid outburst in population and the problem because of it there is necessity for the birth to be controlled there are different birth control methods used let's take a look at few of the ways abstinence method one of the natural method is abstinence some people define abstinence as not having vaginal intercourse when a woman might get pregnant this is better described as periodic abstinence which is one of the fertility awareness based methods of birth control pill method another method is pills birth control pills are a kind of medication that women can take daily to prevent pregnancy these are also sometimes called the pill or oral contraception iud intrauterine devices another effective method is iud or intrauterine devices which is a surgically implanted copper device that prevents sperm from reaching the egg mirena also surgically implanted works by releasing hormones intrauterine devices iud's are more than 99% effective and good for 10 years barrier method another method also known as barrier method in which the ovum and the sperm are stopped from any type of physical meeting surgical method surgical methods such as vasectomy and tubectomy blocks gamete transport thereby prevent conception vasectomy is done in male 
small portion of vas deferens is tied through a small incision on the scrotum. Tubectomy in female by removing a small part of fallopian tube or tied through a small incision in the abdomen or through vagina. Condoms Condoms are barriers made of latex used by males and females both to prevent meeting of sperm to the egg. Diaphragm, cervical caps and walls are also examples of barrier method inserted into the female reproductive tract. Sterilization is a form of birth control. All sterilization procedures are meant to be permanent. They are done both in males and females. During a sterilization procedure, a health care provider closes or blocks a woman's fallopian tubes. Closing the tubes can be done in several ways.